सबको मालूम है कि इस साल से हम नेशनल एजुकेशन पॉलिसी जो है जम्मू कश्मीर के तमाम कॉलेजेस में लागू कर रहे हैं ये नेशनल एजुकेशन पॉलिसी इसमें बहुत सारे जो है बच्चों के लिए अच्छे फीचर्स हैं जैसे इसमें फ्लेक्सिबिलिटी है इसमें मल्टीपल एंट्री मल्टीपल एग्जिट है इसमें बच्चों को बहुत सारे मजमून में तालीम हासिल करने की सहूलियात अवेलेबल है तो हमें उम्मीद है कि नेशनल एजुकेशन पॉलिसी जब लागू हो जाएगी तो इसके साथ ना सिर्फ बच्चे बहुत से डिफरेंट चीज़ों में पढ़ाई कर सकेंगे लेकिन उनकी एम्प्लॉयबिलिटी भी बढ़ जाएगी उनकी स्किल्स भी बढ़ जाएंगी और ओवरऑल जो है एक बेटर क्वालिटी की बेहतर क्वालिटी की तालीम हासिल कर सकेंगे थैंक यू सर डॉक्टर पी यू हुसैन वाइस चांसलर कश्मीर यूनिवर्सिटी डॉक्टर नीदोफर खान वाइस चांसलर कश्मीर यूनिवर्सिटी डॉक्टर यासमी डायरेक्टर कॉलेजेस डॉक्टर प्रिंसिपल ऑफ दिस कॉलेज प्रोफेसर प्रोफेसर डॉक्टर मुश्ताक सिद्दीकी साहब एक्स वाइस चांसलर इस्लामिक यूनिवर्सिटी कॉलेज प्रिंसिपल्स प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ ऑर्गेनाइजिंग कॉलेजेस डिस्टिंग्विश पैनलिस्ट It's a matter of great delight for me to be coming here today and speaking to all of you on a matter which has been extremely close to my heart. I have been speaking off and on to all of you about this policy, the need to implement this policy, and the change that this policy will bring about in all that so far has been wrong with our higher education. The national education policy was unveiled in 2020 after great deliberations at all levels by the government of India. And we just heard from director colleges how under the instructions of the honorable lieutenant governor of Jammu and Kashmir two seminars were organized one of which was addressed by none other than the honorable president of India. The president of India reiterated his thoughts and views when he was in Jammu last month at the convocation of the Indian Institute of Management Jammu. He said that Jammu and Kashmir should be the leader the torch bearer in this sphere of higher education. It has been leading the ideas feet for 5000 years. It's one of the oldest recorded civilizations. it has bequeathed so many ideas in all spheres and that is why all of us are here the policy has been unveiled as i said after a great deal of discussion deliberation suggestions from all concerned and i dare say that we are now at a stage when the time for further deliberations and discussions is over the roads of deliberation the doors of deliberation are in one sense been closed and now it is time to implement the package which all of us have through by consensus and by discussion subject combinations that we are going to offer the majors and the minors that we are going to offer are going to be altered accordingly in consonance with the program which has been unveiled by the ugc so our guiding principle our guiding light shall be the program which is unveiled by the ugc and that is the program that we are going to all follow so as i said there are going to be some compulsory programs some compulsory courses that part as part of the program for example uh, a course on history tradition a course on skills uh, uh, a course on uh, science so those small two credit courses or three credit courses will be an integral part of the program and after three semesters there will be major and minor options